Welcome back, everybody. I apologize for the background noise, but it's about 80 degrees in my apartment, and it's, like, close to 100 outside. And I need to have the air conditioner on. This is insane. I'm afraid that if I don't, that uh, my computer is going to overheat and turn off. So, yes, I apologize for the noise in the background. You know that butcher shop, the cut above? I want to know what the crooked man is hiding at that butcher shop. You know, Bigby, once you show up there, word is going to spread. There may be nothing left for you to see if you go to the Lucky Pawn after. Well, I guess I'll find out. Since it can't be in three places Wait, at once. I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the crooked man, but is there any way you could help us out? I... What do you mean? Well... Maybe you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate it. What do you say? Can you help us out? I'll handle it. I'm not gonna let that crooked bastard ruin any more lives. Oh, thank you, Big B. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Can you sound more condescending? I mean, seriously. That cigarette doesn't look lit. Ah, no smoking. <laughs> ah, I gotta love that cola brand cola. Sausages. Not very appetizing. No, it all looks frozen solid. Who'd want to eat this? Bet that's what Beast was talking about. Hmm. That logo looks familiar. I've seen this before at Anti Greenleafs. Big Beat Wolf? Hey, buddy. <clears throat> well, welcome, Sheriff. Uh, what can I get for you? You interested in a particular cut? The sirloin. Um, let's see. What do we have in stock? Let's, uh, let's see what we got here. Plank steak on special, New York strip. Uh, oh, I can have some wild boar in tomorrow if you like. Uh, sirloin, ribs. Johan, I want to know exactly what's going on here. We sell meat. Did you want to buy something? <laughs> You're nervous. What you see is what you get. Just meat. You don't find anything else. We just, uh, we do more wholesale and meat packing than walk-up service. I'd like to help you. Really, I would. But there's uh, nothing here. So you don't mind if I take a look around? I guess not. <laughs> I, sure Sheriff, I... I... Uh-huh. Did you hear that? What? Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Butcher? I just have to go see. God damn it. Shit. Well, this is creepy, to say the least. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Relax, Johan. I just want to talk. 
I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Such an innocent guy, you're acting pretty damn strange, Johan. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. Hey, you can tell me what's going on, for starters. Oh, you got to be kidding me. You're going to kill me. Oh, God, she is going to fucking kill me. Guessing you mean Mary. <laughs> He's going to get me killed. <laughs> Things I do. Huh? Please, please, Bigby. Please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I don't want to die. Please, please don't kill me. Listen, just calm the fuck down, okay? I just want some answers. Oh, okay. okay. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you can keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. What would you do? It was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy, even when they got down a hook in the deep freeze. Nay, hey, you mean Mary? Bloody Mary? This isn't my shop anymore. That crew took it from me a long time ago. Crew? Fuck. The crooked man's people. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case. That is an Mary. understatement. You want to talk about the real butcher? It's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. Okay. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear. A and I don't want to know. It's all right. I believe you. Calm down. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. Quick time! You always surprise me. Come on. Have I found the glamour shop? I think I found the glamour shop. Or a type of glamour, maybe. I, I don't know. Oh, God. What is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Warning lights. It's business. It's all I've ever had. I get why you flipped that switch, but you had a choice. You could have told me. If you hadn't warned them, I might be dealing with your problem right now. Told you? Huh. You come in here making trouble for me. But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. You tried to kill me, Where yeah. Where were you when they took this place from me? It hasn't been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? I needed help. Well, I'm here now. I'm gonna sort this all out. If it kills me, gosh. So this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours, other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. What are they making here? I'm just a butcher. You want to talk T-bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. Chains? Who's getting chained up here? You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. No, I'm sure you're not. I know quite a lot of people who probably are. 
I'd explain certain spell rib or magic to ribbons. These are raw materials for making magic. Anti Greenleaf and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Don't you see what's going on here? It's a magical meth raw lab. Materials. Looks like he could process them into just about any kind of magic. He's got all he needs. The gear. And slave labor to work at. So these must be the orders. He's got his hooks into everybody. But it's pretty clear how. Oh yeah? How? Doing it like this, it's bound to be cheaper than the 13th floor. This is just horrible. The things that must have gone on here. It's the putting in pie girls with the ribbons. Whoever he's got in here in these chains, he's... He's enslaving fables. On my watch, people just don't know the real cost of getting something cheap. You don't have to tell me. Fucker, Crane knew all about it. Yeah, what about Crane? If this all... I mean, finding the crooked man is so Good fucking God. important. Why don't you ask your boss? Yeah, it's... Snow. No, Crane. He said he knows where everybody is. I don't know how, but he's got some way. That's right. It was that creepy magic mirror with the big green head and all. Why don't you just use that? Find the crooked man that way. And leave me alone. Yeah, with stuff like that mirror, I'm surprised that you ever need to leave the office. Crane shattered the mirror and made off with one of the pieces. He probably still has the shard with him. Well, if they got their hands on an important magical item, there's only one place they'd take it. Oh? Please? Please? The Lucky Pawn. Ah, They probably balls. took Crane there, too. The Lucky Pawn. If I can find the mirror piece there, I can find the crooked man. Hey, hold on. Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? Huh? Do you really think this is gonna be all right? Of all this stuff in here, I do know one thing. That's his icon, his symbol. What kind of a guy uses a torture device as his icon? <laughs> the kind guy of guy that's messed who isn't up. gonna be understanding about Big B Wolf showing himself in. So tell me this. What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm gonna have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. They won't care that I held up my end. Report to the business office. Tell Snow I sent you there, and we'll uh we'll figure something out. Some kind of protection. Thank you. Thank you, Sheriff. Don't thank me just yet. I mean, you do have to make it to the business office without them killing you. Therein lies... Therein lies the problem. I guess with that, we'll catch you next time. Stay excellent, my friends.